Hey everybody, what's going on? Hello! Happy St. Patrick's Day. We got the hat back up again. I tried to turn it down a little though. It's fine, right? It's not too blinding. Welcome to my Timu haul. I've got this huge... Whoa, man. Now settle down, Timu. I got this huge, huge bag with three orders in it here let's smile for a thumbnail just in case just in case i forget okay cheese look at let me tell you about my hair i use that new company the new company if you watched my fab fit fun unboxing yesterday i got this hair density and volumizing shampoo and conditioner by this company called the new company and my hair has never been more flat in my life now it's really really soft and if i curled it i bet it would look really pretty if i curled it it would probably hold the style really well and also what I did before this video was I took this living proof volumizing dry shampoo and I sprayed it all in my and that just made my hair into a big mess and it smell I hate the way living proof um dry shampoo smells and now I just smell like it and my hair's flat again so flat head anyway let's get to how was your day mine was great you know, I worked. I worked on my little spreadsheets. I got caught up on some videos. I like it when I have spreadsheets to work on because then I can kind of listen to your YouTube videos while I mindlessly plug stuff into spreadsheets. Well, not mindlessly, but you know, my boss watches this, so I better actually just stop talking about my shop right now. She knows what I mean. I was just copying businesses and pasting them into another spread. Just never forget it. Forget it. What's in here? The first thing in here is... I have other things I wanted to tell you about, but I don't remember what they are. I'll figure it out later. Um, some more organizational tools. I'm one of those people who buys a bunch of organizational tools... And then just throws them all in a pile. And so among all the things I have to organize, there's like a pile of organizational tools just sitting there waiting to be used. But no, I'm dead serious about it this time. Because you know what? You know what? I am not going to go to Tokyo and come back to a hellhole of a mess. Like this place is going to be... B and B. What is it? What is that company called? B and B, not B and B. It's called um. Well, I don't know, but it's going to be spotless, as if people could rent out my room and stay in it and be happy about Airbnb. What's the matter with me? This place is going to be Airbnb quality. Martha Stewart approved showcase interior, you know, living or whatever that magazine is called. Centerpiece worthy, clean, and shiny when I leave for Tokyo. For two reasons. One, if for some reason I just, something happens and I don't make it better. Now, knock on wood. Now, stop thinking like that, but you never know. I don't want, you know, a big mess to be left behind. And then also, I want to, when I come home, I want to come home to cleanliness. Okay, this is a, wait a minute. Cracked? You know what? I don't care. I will try to get my money back for the, what did I pay for this thing? Um, I'll try to get my money back. But right these days, Timu's being a little bizotch if I do say so no offense Timu but they really are demanding that you send things back they're, they're not they're like over that whole oh just keep the thing and here's your money they don't do that anymore 
Okay, I paid $4.78 for this, and it's still $4.78, and there's a hole in one of them. And, it, whoa, okay, the lid comes off, and then these things, did, well, I'm assuming they have to come off so you can put stuff in them. I mean, they each have a little handle. Oh, oh, okay, you flip each handle down. Okay, I get, I got it now, I got it. You flip each handle down. So you flip this handle down, and then you flip this handle down. A nail is going to come off. I can feel it. Oh, and then the la that layer comes off, and then you've got this layer with the cracked, broken. Now that's a shame. Well, it's not going to compromise the integrity of the... I mean, it's not like something's going to fall out of this. It's just unsightly. But... Oh, well, I didn't buy this thing for looks. I bought it for util utilitarian purposes. Okay, now I got to figure out how to put this back together. It's not really fitting. Okay, there. Okay, so you can put all kinds of things in this. I mean, I'm, I was going to put jewelry in it. Or, yeah, diamond painting stuff. I say that with everything. You would think with all the things that I buy that I go, I'm going to put diamond painting stuff in this that I have like 19 diamond paintings going at one time. I still have one that I started before Halloween and no, I haven't made any progress on it. I need to hydrate already. Okay, how are you doing? Let's all hydrate together. Open up this bottle of water. Oop. Okay, I feel better. When I got home from work, I was having some chest pains. Now, it might have been because I was thinking about some stuff at work that was stressing me out a little, but I took my propranolol when I got home. I should have taken it this morning. It's a beta blocker. But um, I feel better now. I just feel, yeah, I feel better now. Thanks for asking. And I ordered some vitamin D3 with vitamin K, and um, that's coming tomorrow. And the next thing that we have in here is this. I'm looking forward to trying these. Just hold up. Wait a minute. Let me call them up. Four. No, that's a two. <laughs> two, four. They're, they look the same. Two ninety nine. dollars is what I paid, and they're now two sixty nine, and I did get a price adjustment. I bought these half lashes. Look at that! Now look, these are smallish, and maybe I won't have to cut them to size. I still want to get some rockin' lash extensions, like Mimi on um, Mimi's life has. But the last time I got lash, lash extensions, the lady got all stressed out and said my existing lashes were not long enough for her to... I mean, she managed to do it, but she said it was really hard because I barely have any lashes. And I felt ashamed. I felt like lash shamed. She lash shamed me. And um, I don't want to be shamed like that again. But I do want to kind of get extensions. Like before I go to Tokyo, blonde hair and lashes. Okay, so here they are. And let's see, if I peel one off, will I be able to cram it back on there? I don't have any glue or anything like that. I just want to hold one up and see. I just want to hold one up and see what it does. Okay, okay. It goes on the outside, and then I'm, wait a minute. All right, it's got some sticky stuff on it, but you do need glue. There's no way, you guys, I, I could never put on, I am so jealous of people who effortlessly put on fake lashes. I can't do it. Don't use your monitor as a mirror. Yes, I have to. I'm sorry. And what? My face is getting shiny. Oh, man. Come on. I can't catch it. There. That looks hot. 
No, really, if I glued this end down and this end down and yeah, sure. I mean, what I like about these is that they're not like atrociously long that they look like crazy. Like, girl, get out of here with your big fake lashes crazy. I don't know. Like, see, they just look like I have decent mascara on. If I glue these edges down and clamp them together with one of those little tools. And I'm trying to imagine. Just hold on a minute while I envision. There. All right. Anyway, that's not really how you should put them on. But you need glue and it didn't come with glue. They don't come with glue, but you do get, who's texting me? No, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pairs of these half lashes that you just put on the ends, which I really liked that better than the whole ones because the whole ones are usually too big and too long for my lashes and I got to trim them down and I can never do that. Now, yeah, I am just making sure this isn't, my mom downstairs, there she is. Oh, she's just sending me something from Twitter. Stop it. All right, she's always sending me um, <laughs> tweets about, I mean, I'm sorry, X. She's always sending me X posts about cats and stuff. Bless her heart. But really, I get, you know, when I see a text from her, I get like, oh, oh, something's wrong. What's wrong? It's an emergency. What? And then, no, it's just a silly tweet. Okay, cut some more of this bag and let's see what else is in here. Okay, so I have to remember to stretch out my neck and I've got the, oh no, we have a la we have a nail emergency. I've got the beautiful... Biwaku, Biwako, Biwako, pearl necklace on tonight, and um, I didn't wear it today, I just put it on for this video, today I did the Coco Chanel thing, and I put everything on, and then I decided to take one thing off. A Coco Chanel rule where right before you walk out the door, take one. I, don't, I think it was Coco Chanel, right? Who said, you know, right before you walk out the door, be sure you take it one thing off. Because, you know, I got the, the prosperity bracelets. Ooh, one of them's turning colors. And then um, I got the, and these are covered up though. I I don't wear these really for show. So really, I just wore this, and I got this way sparkly sweater on that's supposed to be Hermes dupe that, yes, I got on Timu, and no, I don't have the link. I'm sorry. Okay, oh, and if you're new to my channel, hi. I like to talk a lot. I like to take my time, and I sometimes we have impromptu nail breaks where we glue fingernails back on because I am a little bit neurotic about them and they are coming off. In fact, they don't ma they don't even match. <laughs> I got a bunch of mismatched ones on today because some of them cuz these uh these are I've been wearing them for weeks and they are done and they are popping off and I cannot find the replacements, but I can find the replacement ones to these whitish ones with these glittery tips. So now I've just got like, my hands look like a hot mess, but I keep them far away and I just keep moving them really fast so nobody can really tell. All right, what else is in this thing? This thing, this looks like, oh dear, I have, why do I have a horrible, horrible, horrible feeling this is a mug? Now if you're new to my channel, my mom is not happy with all the mugs <laughs> that I've been buying on Timu. We have run out of room in our cabinets for the mugs. But in my defense, the mugs that were in our cabinets before I started spicing things up a little bit with Timu mugs, the mugs we had were just mismatched, ugly, like promotional item mugs, like the kind you get for opening a bank account or something. Thanks for opening an account. Here's a mug. 
you know, like that, those kind of, they had no personality or whatever. So I am still of the opinion that we need to throw all the old mugs out and put the new mugs in. I like this one. Oh, wow. It's beautiful. Isn't it a masterpiece to start your day with? It's got raised dots on it. See what I mean about the mismatched fingers? It's got raised dots on it. It's got a beautiful pattern around the inside. I feel like I'm on QVC. <laughs> Selling out fast. We only have 10 left. Um, the bottom says China. Just in case, just in case you forget where it was made, it's right there in big letters. And it's got a black handle, and yeah, woo, it's perfect. I wish it had coffee now, because man, I'm a little bit tired. Okay, so, but mom, we've always had that mug, I swear. So yeah, my thing has been to sneak them in the thing like one at a time, kind of in the middle of the night when she's asleep or whatever, I don't know, sneak them downstairs, sneak them in the cupboard. And then like when she goes, where did this mug come from? I'll go, I, I tried the whole thing, but mom, we've always had that mug. What's the matter with you? What's going on with your memory? That's so mean to do, though. That's mean. Okay, that mug, it was probably $20. You know how expensive the mugs are on Timu? They're ridiculously expensive. And I always end up buying them. They're always like $15, $20. This one was $11.98. And it is now $8.39. And just so you know... You can get it in a whole bunch of colors, and I'm kind of filled with regret. This always happens to me. Why didn't I get the pink one? Because that one looks pretty cool. And I really like the green one, too. I like them all. I want the whole set. There's even, like, a clear one, which is cool. So, yeah, I will try my best to link to these orders in my description of this video below. So, $11.98. Okay, well, good. That's a decent price for it. While we're at it, we might as well look at this one, too. Because this feels like it's going to be a mug. Now, look, someday I'm going to have my own place with my own cute little mugs. And I'm going to just invite strangers over for coffee just so I can pour it in my cute little mugs. It's going to be fun. Everybody's like, oh my gosh, there's that crazy lady who's always trying to drag us into her apartment for coffee. Yeah, apartment for coffee. I'm never going to own real estate. What I've learned just from living here that a house is a big pain in the neck that I have no desire to have. The yard, the, the fix it yourself if it breaks, all of that. Now, I want to rent, man. I don't Okay, this is beautiful. I'm joking. Now, wait a minute. So, it's a lemon mug. It's got lemons on it. But I am thoroughly disappointed that there are no lemons on this side. And why is there a, just like a yellow splotch right here? It's like they started to paint the lemons and they just got really tired and said, Oh, forget it. We don't want to paint anymore. We're sick of painting lemons. I don't know. I don't know. I give this one a blah. This one can go in the... I'm sorry I made a mistake. Put it in the donation bag. Well, how much did I pay for it? I paid $6. What do I expect? I paid $6.64. It's kind of cute. Like I have a fondness for lemons because when I was a little girl, my grandma... Um, now, of course, deceased, passed, um, my dad's mom, she had a big fake, now this is back in the 70s, she had a big fake lemon tree in her living room, and it was really cool, and I loved it, and it was so 70s, it was awesome, and so... Yeah, I miss my grandma a lot, and I love lemon 
things with lemons on them because they remind me of my grandma and her big lemon tree. But that mug does not live up to my expectations. Okay, so it was I paid six sixty four, which is shockingly low price, and it's now nine forty seven, and you can get it with strawberries or tangerines or whatever those are on it, too. So, but just be mindful that the design, either it's supposed to go all the way around and they just gave up on mine, or um, it only goes to one side, which is just lame. Then the other, then, I don't know, other people can't enjoy it while you're drinking your coffee. Or you can't enjoy it. Throw that over there. Okay, the next thing in here is a little tiny. Now look, I needed this to be much bigger. This is a car bumper sticker that you'd have to be right up on me to read. Like this, is, when you get a bumper sticker, you want a bumper sticker. Well, you know what? In China, they drive those little tiny cars over there, don't they? And... This is probably right, or don't they, you know, ride around on little bikes? Not, not like pedaling bikes, like motorbikes. I don't know. I haven't been to China. I kind of, I really want to go. But first, Japan. Next, Ireland. Anyway, it says, don't hit me, I'm poor. <laughs> don't hit me, I'm poor. But, you know, you don't have to almost be hitting me. If I put this on my car, like, you could probably only read it if you rear-ended me. I don't know. Okay, that's my second disappointment of the evening. Did I look at the dimensions? No, I didn't think I had to because it said, you know, bumper sticker for car or whatever. And I just thought, oh, okay, we all know what those look like. But what did I pay for that? I paid... I paid two dollars and twenty four cents for that, and it's still two twenty four. I did get a price adjustment, but I don't know. It must have gone up and then down and then up. I mean, it must have gone down and then back up and then down and then back up. Okay, the next thing here is a little envelope. <laughs> wow, my hair is so flat. I'm just like. It's fine. A lot of people have hair that's just long and pretty and straight. But, um, yeah, I look like I've been out in the rain. And I probably won't pose for any thumbnails. Oh, okay. These are Alice in Wonderland fingernails. Look at those. Aren't those fabulous? You get the rabbit, the white rabbit, and then the little playing cards and hearts and the, you know, the little diamond pattern. And yeah, they've got like an Alice in Wonderland vibe. These are really cool. Once again, I'm wondering why didn't I buy two pairs of these? So if I lose one, I'll have a backup pair. I swore to myself that if I ever bought nails like that again... I would buy two pairs, so I'd have a backup if something happened to the first pair. And those were, I'm looking at three orders in one bag, so bear with me while I call. I'm not talking to my friends, I'm calling up the order, and they must be right here. There they are, there they go. Because God forbid Timu put one order in one bag. I paid $4.99 for those. And they're now sold out. Oops, sorry about that. They're atrocious. Forget about them. Here's some really cute. They're way too long for me though. Look at these really long panda ones. Hold on. Pandas and ice cream cones or something. Yeah, I wish I could pull those off. <laughs> There's no way. I love Timu's fingernails. The possibilities are just endless with Timu and their fingernails. 
All right. Time is it? I don't have anything that can tell me. Oh, yes, I do. It's 624. I didn't ask my device. You know what? Because somebody, I was watching YouTube and somebody asked their um, Alexa. Never mind. Something and then mine answered and I was mildly annoyed. And then I thought, oh, now I know how those people feel who get really mad when I do it. Because I was either recording something or no, or I was, I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. I was trying to pay attention to something and I didn't want to hear, you know, oh dear, my fingers are, it will only fit on leave me alone. I'm engaged. Finger. Okay. Look at how cool that ring is. You guys, isn't it pretty? It's like an enamel white and blue. Nice. Okay, pretty. I love rings. I, I wonder how many I have. I bet if I took a guess, I would probably have about 250 rings at least. Thanks to Timu. I don't know. I should count them one day when I'm bored. Okay, 269 is what I paid for that, and it's still 269 and beauty and elegance flower pattern symbol okay so neat i wish i had a bigger bag so i could start putting this little trash in it but well, maybe this is something wow what is this oh my word okay well here's a big bag this is a duffel bag that I might just end up using as a carry-on bag. Now, I'm starting to look at all my bags and trying to figure out what's going to be my carry-on bag. Now, if you're new to my channel, I'm going to Tokyo in a few months. A couple of months. Three months. And I'm already excited about it. And this is a... I really wanted the white. Okay, so I got this bag as a spin the wheel deal or something. But they only gave me the option to have the black one. And I really wanted the white one. But the black one's cool. It's like a big black duffel bag with it snaps closed and zips closed. And then the inside has got like some zipper pockets. And some slip pockets, the usual things you find. It doesn't have any compartments. It does have this strap, which shoulder strap, which is good. And ugh, I'll deal with this later. So that's pretty cool. And yeah, I'll deal with this later. But I like the sequin tiger or whatever. Hold it up. Oh, Lord, I can't. I can't. All right, hold it up for a thumbnail. Looks like I just came in from the rain. <laughs> Some, last time my hair was this flat, somebody goes, when I looked at your thumbnail, I thought you would just come in from the rain. <laughs> okay, cheese. I don't know. Cheese. Hello. Um, someone asked how the thumbnails work. The thumbnails, the little pictures that you see when you look at the list of videos to play. And they're like, why? when you say cheese and stuff, how does your compute, your iPad know how to take a picture when you do that or what? And No, um, I watch, uh-oh, I just jammed this. I just got this zipper caught. I watch these I kind of fast forward through these videos before I upload them just to make sure, you know, nothing weird is going on that I didn't notice while I was filming. Okay, I really screwed up the zipper, but I'm, I'll fix it later for everyone's sake. And 
it came with a little dust bag, which we don't really care about. And what I'm really excited about is the big plastic bag because I need to put all this little trash in here and then I will feel so much better about my life. Okay, keep this right there. All right, that bag, I, it looked cooler in the picture though, I think. And it was probably not in this order that I'm on. Probably in the next order. Yep. I'll show you the picture and you'll probably agree that it looked cooler in the picture. Classic sequin cat pattern, $16.49. Whoa, when it's now $25.95. See, here's the white one, which is the one I kind of have like, what is it? Not FOMO, but what do you call it when you did miss out and you feel regret? And here's the black one in the picture. I don't know. I like the white one. Part of me wants to buy the white one. Don't buy the white one. Don't do it. Just, I'll stick it in my cart just in case. Only one available. White's the only one available left. I'm going to throw it in my cart just in case I win the lottery or something. I did just look at my bank account because, you know, I got to, I got to pay attention to what I'm spending, what I'm saving, what I'm doing. And everything's fine, but I was a little bit worried. This is really cool, you guys. This is a bracelet that you can get customized and with your name. E-R-I-N-N. -N. They spelled it correctly. It's silver. And it's small, which is good. I'm not small, small, but, you know, it's adjustable like this. That's my name. Don't wear it out. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, I re so I'll watch these videos, and then if I spend those thumbnails that I'm always going, cheese, I'll pause it and screenshot it and then upload it as my, my thumbnail. So, that's how I get my thumbnails. I don't just hope. Why, how do I have glitter all over my face still? Okay, anyway, there, there you go. Take that, Wonder Woman. So, I think that was only about five dollars, you guys, to get a personalized bracelet with your name on it. Now, will it turn green in a day or two? <laughs> Maybe, but that's pretty special. Let me see if I can find it quickly before everybody leaves in disgust. And I will stand in the rain on the corner, partially delivered. Oh, my heart is broken. I don't know, you guys. I might not be able to find it. Maybe it's because I don't have my glasses on. I'm stuck on Fool in the Rain by Led Zeppelin. That's the song that's currently in my... I don't know. I'm so embarrassed to say that I don't know. But I, I really think that it was $4 and something cents. Take a deep breath. Don't panic. That could be it right there. You know what would help if I put my glasses on? Those are fingernails. Oh, I almost bought those today. Oops. I'm glad I did not. Do, 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 do. No, I don't know. When we see it, I'll let you know. But I, I, I would like bet money, my hard-earned money on um, somewhere around the lines of, ooh, is that a spider? Don't. Look it. What is that? I don't know what it is, but get it off. Here, get this out of here and get this out of my life. Ooh, there's something in there. 
don't get all my notebooks. <sighs> okay. Here, hold on a minute. I can't. I like spiders. I actually like them when they're alive or whatever. I like them because they eat mosquitoes and other bugs that annoy me. But I just don't like to be surprised by one. Look at this cool Lego notebook, you guys. So it snaps closed like Legos. And then you open it like Legos and it's lined and it's got little... What? Is it upside down? No, you put your name and your business and all of that stuff in the beginning. And then you just keep a little journal or notes or whatever. And that delighted me so much that I bought two. And those were right there. They're right there. I found them. See more order information. Light up the love that I found. Love that I found. Okay, $5.98 is what I paid for it. And they're now still $5.98. And you can get all the colors except red. So, aren't they fun? They're so fun. And I got pink and then I got a blue one. Is there anything gross in this bag? No. I would save this and give it away as a giveaway, but no. <laughs> Keeping it. Okay, I can't wait, man. No wonder people don't take me seriously at work sometimes. With my Lego notebooks? Really? Okay, um, I need to put this chain, if I put this behind my head, there, it looks a little better back. Okay, what else is in here? Underwear? Show your underwear on YouTube? I'll just show one pair. I got some underwear with, <laughs> with skulls on it. Because I thought it was cute. Wait, I gotta feel it. Uh, I don't like the way it feels. It feels kind of slidey, you know, like um, satiny. It's cute. There's my underwear, everybody. I can't believe I just did that. Okay, it does have a cotton gusset. Okay, now, how, how did they fold that up in such a neat, nice, neat way? So, and there are other ones with different patterns. And no, I'm not taking every pair out. That was embarrassing enough as it is. It was really embarrassing. Like, really? Like, what if some dude that I work with is watching this or something? Oh, well. Okay, for the underwear, I paid... Does anybody really care? You get three pairs for $2.95. That's a good deal. Now, that's what we call a good old-fashioned Timu deal. Three pairs of underwear for $2.95. And they're still $2.95. And they are hipster. Cut. I don't know what that is. I'm definitely not a hipster. And then this is... A really cheesy looking necklace, but speaking of Hermes, this is the necklace with the H that if I would have opened this would have gone great with this fake Hermes sweater. Hermes. Is it Hermes? Hermes or is it Hermes? I think you say it like you say airhead, Hermes. I don't know. I can't afford it. I do know that. Okay, that's all I know about that fashion house is that I can't afford it. And would it have killed them to put the little H? So here's the little H. 
that goes on this very yellow gold chain that, I don't know, I just would have liked it to be a little more muted. Oh, you know my nail's gonna come off when I open this. Okay, I'm not doing this right now. It's too difficult. In fact, it might even be stuck. I don't know. I can't. <laughs> I'm like, eh, I can't get it off, you guys. I'll fix it later, but eventually I'll open this up. I'll slide, you slide the H through there, and then you just wear your H hanging down and people will be like, why do you have an H around your neck? And you'll be like, it's high fashion, darling. Don't you know anything? I don't want to know what I paid for that because it's stupid. Like that, there it is right there. Um, I paid $1.99 for that and it was discontinued probably, yeah, because it was a knockoff. All right. Next is this rolly thing. How are we doing on time? 41 minutes. I totally lost track of time, space, and everything. I don't know where. So I hired a shorts editor. She's the one who makes my shorts. And her info is in my channel description in case anyone else wants to hire a shorts editor, but I don't know where she is. Like, I don't know how this relationship with her <laughs> works. Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to tell her when I want shorts or if she's supposed to be watching and just making them as inspiration strikes her, which is how I kind of would like it to be because I, I don't know how I want shorts, video shorts, not the kind you wear. But I was just thinking today that I haven't heard from her in a while. And I try to pay her pretty, you know, I pay her well. I pay her a lot more than what she um, asked for. Because she her rates were too low. And I was like, honey, your rates are too low. All right, this is a canvas print. <laughs> it reminded me of Loki. It's a black cat with bangs digging into somebody's arm or some body part right there with blood coming. I have no idea, you guys. I don't know. It looked, first of all, I didn't know it would be this big. I should have paid attention to what the size that I was ordering. And then second of all, I might hang it downstairs as a joke somewhere where my mom can see. Because my mom calls Loki that little monster. She's always like, where's that little monster? Aw, poor Loki. He's my little boy. He's so sweet. He loves to grab people's arms and give kisses and stuff. He's, a, he's the sweetest cat I've ever had in terms of he just likes to grab your hand and like just lick it. But, um, and then Luna, she, I don't see much of her when I'm, like, when I'm here, I don't see much of Luna, my other cat Luna, but then I will, like, wake up in the middle of the night and she'll be smushed up against me sleeping. So, oh, look, I found things. I found things we've been looking for. Okay, the bracelet. Let's see if I would have lost money on that bet. Four ninety four. I knew it. That customized bracelet, which is sold out, but here is another one. Oh, you can get two sizes, two styles. You can get it in gold or silver, and okay, cool. But this is not my seller. This is some other seller. And so, customized English letter bracelet is how you would find that. But my seller is sold out. But I did pay four ninety four for it. And then that picture of that cat retro canvas print poster is three dollars and forty one cents is what I paid for it, and it's now two seventy eight. Okay. 
take out? Okay. This video, I'm afraid, is going to be long. This is a body shaper. I think. Yeah, it's like a long line body shaper. Although the legs don't really look like they're going to hold much in. I don't know. It's got lace at the bottom, but I will show you the picture of it so you can see. I'm kind of excited to see what this will do and with high hopes, but low expectations. I'll show you the picture. If I were, you know, an editor, a video editor, I would put it right, right here, a picture, which is what I'm trying to do for this one video that I'm making that's never going to see its debut because it's so frustrating and it takes a lot of time because I have like 13 outfits and I'm trying to put pictures of each one up here in this little blank space. I should give it all to my shorts editor if I can find her and just say, look, could you help me do this thing and I'll pay you whatever you want. Okay, women's slimming, waist training, blah, blah, blah. $9.99 is what I paid for it and it's now $11.19. Get this video out of here. And it looks like I don't know, man. I'm curious to see what this is going to look like on. It crisscrosses your body like this when you have it on. So, I don't know if it does anything for your thighs, which is really what I need. In terms of, like, sucking them in. I don't know. And it also has got a butt lifting design in the back. It's got these butt straps in the back. <laughs> That's exciting. And it says shape smaller thighs, reduce the appearance of cellulite and dimples on thighs, firm midsection. I don't know. I'll try it. I need it. But I should have gotten it nude. You can get it in white. I know what I was thinking. I was thinking if I like it, then I'll get it in nude. What did I get it in? I got it in a large, size large. So I'll see how it fits. And then if I like it, I'll get it in nude. And this looks like yet another purse. And it might even be one that I already own. But this crossbody will be cool. Or actually, no, Simply Jessica Marie got me a really cool crossbody that I love. But some kind of crossbody will be good for traveling. And this is Saint Laurent. It's trying to be Ivy Saint Laurent. Okay, it's trying to be something it's not. It's trying to be designer. It's got a big strap. And then the inside is just the inside with nothing going on in the inside. There are no pockets in here. It's just really, really basic. It's got checkers. And yeah, I mean, it looks like maybe it could be something. And I don't think I paid very much for that. She said, hopefully, oh, it stinks. Okay. Light up the love that I found. Okay, it's only 648. Let me make sure that my mom is not texting me about this manicotti. Okay, she's not. We're having manicotti for dinner. Okay, so how much was that thing? I don't know. It was right there. I paid, 
$8.24 and it is still $8.24. And you can get it in white, green trim, and the black is sold out. Okay. Next, I got some little socks with little fake pearls on the tops of them. So, I think I got one, two, three, four, five pairs of socks with little pearls on top of them. And that, I hope that was like a good old-fashioned Timu deal. Uh, I paid $7.19 for them. And they are now $7.99. So, not so much. Not so much a good old-fashioned team deal. Okay, next in here is <laughs> a sticker of a little lamb saying, Check yourself! <laughs> Cheese. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. I'm going to put this on my laptop. I'm not a rapper. All right, that's hilarious. I kind of need to have that right in front of my face at all times. I need that. What if I took this into a tattoo artist and said, look, could I, can I just get this like right here or right here? Would they do it? They'd do it, wouldn't they? Okay, the next thing I got are these little... Um, they're like Van Cleef dupes. Did I say that correctly? Van Cleef and Arpel. I don't know. I'm not highfalutin. I shop at, at Timu like a billionaire, but they're pretty. Yeah. I would have worn these today. <gasps> he came in like a wrecking ball. Hi. How are you doing, Loki? I was missing you. We were talking about you. Are you coming over to say hello? Check yourself before you come over here and say hello to all your friends. Okay, those earrings. Loki's just off camera. I'm petting him right now. He'll be here in a minute. Those earrings are $149 and they're now $134. And Luna is right behind him. And I just am scared all of a sudden that everything's going to go to hell in a handbasket. Next, we got some nails. Hi, Loki. What you thinking about? Little. Okay. All right. Hi. 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 Be careful. Okay, so the next thing, um, here comes the Luna. Okay, what are you guys doing? Don't you guys have something else to do? I might wear these tomorrow. They're like clear nails with little, like, birthday cake sparkles on them. In fact, I think I got them because I'm like, oh, I could wear these on my birthday. Like, okay. Hi. You kind of stink, actually. Pew, could you go this way? Because you smell sort of bad. Yuck, she needs to clean her bottom. There they are. Okay, everybody get out of here, please. And they come with um, stickers and a cuticle pusher and a nail file. And I don't use any, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't use the little jelly things to stick them on. Oh, the check yourself. Um, 161 that sticker is and was. It's what I paid for it and that's what it is. And those nails, I don't know. When we see those nails, I'll let you know how much they cost. Okay, because we're going to be here all night. All night. The next thing in here is, holy cow, there are so many little things in here. Really? It says, but first coffee... I, did I really get a t-shirt that says that? Okay, let's do the field test. Okay, it's soft. I got it in 1XL. 
I must have gotten it in like either a man's size or oh, here he comes again. But first, coffee, coffee, coffee. It's got one of the letters is a leopard print. Oh, and then the word. I mean, it's cute. I think I just got it to bum around the house in. Right, Loki? Okay, I'm trying to fold this actually and put it away. Okay. All right. Could you? It's a blackout. All right. I feel like we need to take a break, but there's no pause button. <laughs> if there were a pause button, I would take a break. Okay. That's men's coffee print, men's casual shirt or whatever. Six twenty two is what I paid for it, and it's now six fifty seven. You can get it in black, blue, green, brown, white. What is that? You found a toy? Okay, you can get it in all of those. All hell is breaking loose here. Okay. Next thing we have is... Is it more underwear? Shapewear? What is it? Don't step on my coffin mugs, girl. Um, it's a tank top, I guess. Cute. And it feels really soft. And it's ruched on the sides. And I don't know, it seems pretty small for me, though. I'll have to try it. But I, here she comes. There he goes. Okay, tank top. Ribbed. Ruched on the sides. Are you stuck? Hey, you're gonna have to go that way. Can you go that way? You gonna jump? We don't really have room right here. Okay, I'm trying to find that tank top. I don't, oh, there it is right there. Square neck tank top, $3.87. And it's now $3.89. And that's Luna. Oh my gosh. And this is the model living her best life in it. And Luna, you smell really bad, girl. Like really bad. Okay. Now, is everybody all right? Am I still even on camera? What's happening here? Put this back. Am I recording? Okay. Is everything okay? All right. Let me take this off. Let me fix this or something, do something with it, try to do something with it. Okay, next thing in here, we're still going. It's an hour, holy cow, is this badass ring. Yeah, I said it on accident, I'm sorry. I try not to curse on this channel, but once in a while, a mild, a mildly bad word will slip out. Okay, so we got, um, hi, what are you doing? You coming back again? Okay, and then are you going to go that way? Watch your nails. Okay, it's a ring, but this part is so small. It is adjustable, but I mean, it's hard to pull apart. I'm afraid I'm going to break it. I'm probably am going to break it, but look at this ring. If I could just get it to... But it's so small, though. Will it fit on? Leave me alone. I'm engaged. <laughs> okay, it'll fit on something. It'll fit on, like, can you imagine typing with this thing on and stuff? Hello. Okay, what I really want. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I can't get it off. Get off. What I really want it to fit on is this finger right here. Okay, this is the finger I want it on. I'm totally wearing this tomorrow. Hey, everybody. Want to go get some coffee? <laughs> I don't know. It makes me laugh. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay, what did I pay for that? 
I paid $125 for this ring and it is now sold out, but they have many others like it. If you just look for exaggerated hip hop style heart ring, exaggerated heart ring, like actually this one is really pretty. Like, why didn't I get this one instead? I don't know. Oh, am I wearing it upside down? I'm totally wearing it upside down, huh? I don't want gold. I want ancient silver. No. Yeah. Add to cart. Okay. So upside down. I'm wearing it upside down. Because it's all about me. But it's supposed to be pointing at the world. Oh, I can't get it off now. I can't get it off. Okay. So it goes a little something like this. Right? Yeah. Okay. Next in here is a little necklace, and I'm not taking it out, but it is a little black clover on a gold chain. Wait a minute. I am taking out it out because I just saw something I don't understand. I don't understand. I'm trying to speed it up just a little bit because it's an hour and one minute. Oh, okay. It's not just a, it's, it's a, okay. It's a black clover and a white sparkly clover together on a chain. Beautiful. And I don't know what I paid for those. And I guess they go like this when they're on. I don't know how they're supposed to look or what they're supposed to do or anything like that. Let me see if I can find somebody living their best life wearing them. Yep. Double clover pendant necklace. I paid $199. It's now $179. And you can choose between black or white in terms of that solid one. I chose the black one and here's what it looks like on. Okay. Pretty. All right. Next. This is the most questionable thing in here. Now, I don't know what I was thinking. So this is a jacket. It looks like tap <laughs> tapestry. It looks like um, upholstery or bad curtains or curtains you would find in some dusty old mansion somewhere, but it's a jacket that looked really cool on the model. Okay, and it's got fringe on the bottom. I'm wearing this tomorrow. Ugh. I might wear this tomorrow. It looks pretty cool. It's got a Prince vibe or the artist formerly known as Prince vibe. I could wear it with these burgundy good. I see some burgundy. I've got some burgundy pants so I could wear it with and some boots and yeah, man. And then wait a minute. Will this go under it? Perhaps. Perhaps this tank top will work under it. Because it is, you know, it was in the 80s today, you guys. Tomorrow, it's going to be, I think, 70-something. I don't know. Something. Or I could wear white. Or I could wear, you know, a black tank top. I don't know. Who knows? I don't know. But I got big dreams for that thing. You can laugh at it all you want. But I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. It might look good. I'll show you what it looks like when someone's wearing it. It looks a little different, but you know, if we don't try different things, we don't, we don't know. I mean, they could be life changing. Could win the jacket of the year award. Jacket of the year. Here it is. And I just thought it looked like something different. Tribal floral tassel hem jacket. I paid $12.99 for it. It's now $13.49. And see, she's rocking it. Kind of. With a black belt and jeans. And there's the back of it. I feel like they pumped up her butt in Photoshop a little bit. 
and see white tank top i'm gonna pose just like that <laughs> i'm sure i'm gonna look exactly like i want to look like that girl that's that's why i bought it because i want to look like that girl all right next we're almost done we just have like a bunch of little things at the bottom so um, okay we're, we're not going to be here as late as i thought we we're the next thing are these golden bow earrings i, I tried again for a dollar 98 i hauled something similar to this the other day except they were really long bows and so these are shorter and i mean maybe or maybe they're just foolish you guys look at it. see this dark line right here i don't know what that is and i'm gonna have to go to a dermatologist and there's another one forming right here two dark lines right here and they're it's not makeup it's like just a two dark patches that are coming down here and here and like on top of everything else really that just stresses me out and it's i couldn't cover it up with concealer or anything today it just it looks like i i have no idea but is it cancer that's my first question about everything and if you go god forbid don't google it because that's what google's first answer to everything is cancer Okay, the next thing in here is a ring that looks like this. I thought it was really unique. It's black and gold with a big diamond, and I'm a little bit concerned. A little bit. I'm a little bit concerned that I don't have a finger it'll fit on right at this moment because I ate a whole bunch of caramel apples that had like 1,800 calories each. Okay, there. Ooh, so... It's nice. It's cool, isn't it? Get these out of the way. It's really different. It would look pretty. Like if you were wearing a black like suit or black, you know, some kind of black ensemble or something. I like it a lot. Okay. I'm happy with it. Can I get it off? You better be happy with it because you can't get it off. Okay. So that ring... I uh, started the whole shebang, I remember, because I added that ring to order, and then I just went nuts and started adding all kinds of things to order. Okay, that ring. Is right here. One click pay. 179 is what I paid for it, and it is still 179. I think it's really cool. Okay, the next thing in here is another ring. I think I think it's all rings from here. Welcome to the Rings on Parade. This ring is kind of like my purple ring, except it's green. Is it adjustable or did I... It is adjustable. It looks like this. Happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. Here. Looks like that. It's a little bit big for that finger. Put it on this. No. Wait a minute. There's no such thing. It's adjustable. Okay, it's adjustable. So anyway, it's a... <laughs> It's adjustable. I just have to adjust it. Stick it on my thumb. There. It looks cool. It looks cool with these bracelets, doesn't it? Okay. I like it. I love rocks like that. And that ring was... I see a lot of things missing, but I guess I don't care. I'm too tired to care. There it is. That ring, I paid $3.14, $3.14. It's green fluorite, and it's still $3.14. And then the next, how many things? We only have like a few more things we have. <laughs> the sticker. 
Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's like the bro. <laughs> Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's like the bro. That's awesome. These two things are my favorites in this whole haul. Not the also the Lego notebooks, but maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Lexa Bro and check yourself before you wreck yourself. Get it out of the glare here. Thumbnail cheese. I don't know if that's gonna work. I don't know what I paid for that, but I'm pretty sure I paid two bucks for that. And then I got this little pin for my mood bag. Now people are like, what's a mood bag? It's literally a canvas bag that you can buy on uh, Timu that says mood on it. And people have been getting them and covering it with pins. And I have a mood bag. I just haven't started putting my pins on it yet. But this made me laugh. It's the Mysterious Leg Bruise Club. <laughs> Because for me, I always have these mysterious, big, scary looking bruises on my legs. I don't know where they came from or how they got there. And yes, I probably need to be um, taking more iron. Although my iron levels were fine in my blood test. But um, yeah, it could be an iron thing or I don't know. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's like a bro. Okay, this is the last thing in here, and it is another one of these because I love my other one. So whenever I love something so much that I can't stand it, I immediately buy another one if it's from Timu because, you know, if it's from Timu, you don't know about how long it's going to be before it turns green or falls apart or whatever. So I bought another one of these purple... Rock rings. Although, I don't know. I don't want to get over there and get that. I don't know if this is the exact same one, but it's kind of got the same vibe. Ah! Oh, no! I can't get it off. I do this every time. It, it is adjustable. But it's a little stubborn. Okay. I don't know. Forget it. I'm not trying to put it on that finger again. I'm not trying. Whatever. Pretend it's all the way down there. Pretend this is gone. It's cool. It's neat. It's different. Now I have two of them. Maybe it's like a pro. Okay. Um, that was fun, you guys. That's all. Now, I really feel like some things are missing, though. But, oh, those nails these nails I paid 349 for those and they're now 314 let me just cruise through these orders for a minute really quickly because I feel like did I get everything I ordered Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Lexapro. I paid one sixty one, and it's still one sixty one. And okay, I got that. I got that. Oh, I see why I'm making the disconnect because they split it into two packages, and I already got one of those packages. Same with this, partially delivered. What? I didn't get anything out of this one. What are you talking about, Timu? Wait a minute now. Something's really missing. Oh, one thing. One item was delivered to my mailbox, and it was an eyeshadow palette. All right. And then the next, the other item has 23. The other package has 23 items in it. All right. You guys, thank you so much for watching. If you watched this long, that's crazy. Thank you. I love and appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for your supporting this channel by watching it, by hitting one of the thumbs, thumbs up or thumbs down, and by leaving your kind, kind comments down below. Thank you. 
And I hope that you are having a great evening or morning or afternoon whenever you're watching this. And I will see you soon. I have a review I think I'm going to be doing tomorrow night. And or unless I get another big bag of Timu stuff. I don't know. We'll do something. But anyway. All right, big Darth Vader kiss goodbye. And now we say, how do we stop this thing? How do I stop?